Okay. <laughs> this video of the tropical rainforest looks really interesting for my sec one job students. Mm -hmm. I think so too. Can you follow me the link? Are you okay? What's wrong? Mm, I was just five minutes too late. Uh, I just sent an SLS lesson to my students. And this would have been a perfect fit. Uh, should I resend an assignment and add this in? I don't. Be so many duplicates, and I have to explain to my students and before they attempt to do the older version, and it's gonna be so messy. Everybody's gonna ask so many questions, and I'm gonna have to. You're in luck. Huh? Did you know that SLS allows us to edit the assignments after they have already been sent to the students? As long as the students have not attempted the question, you can still edit the assignment after you sent it to the students. For example, if you've already sent out questions 1 to 5 and the students have already attempted question 1, you can still edit questions 2 to 5. There is no need to reassign. No more duplicates, lost submissions or confusion from the students and teachers. You mean the SLS team heard us and added this enhancement? It's true! I like how it's more flexible for the teachers now. And the students cannot continue their assignments while you are editing it, so there is no rush to edit. When they enter the assignment, there will be a caption saying, This assignment has been paused. If they are attempting the assignment, a pop-up notification alerts them. Nobody can do anything until you resume assignment. You can even send them a notification to alert them when they can continue on the assignment. Wow! Think of all the times we hesitated to edit our assignments. Now it's easier for us to modify them and also to better cater to our students' learning needs. Also, all the Embarrassing little typo can now be easily and quickly modified without drawing too much attention. Mm. And that's not all. This new release still comes with a course feature that helps us organize lessons. Moving forward, you can design learning packages with multiple lessons, which are called sections under one single course. This removes the clutter from your old assignment list by bundling all the related lessons into a course. You can also create a learning schedule for students by presetting the start and end dates for each section. And now with this new function, we can easily modify our courses and lessons on the fly to address learning gaps. Wow, these features are so useful, especially for home-based learning. It's going to be so much easier for me to plan my lessons in advance and for students to complete their course at their own time, own pace. Yup. With this release, you can now focus on the big picture without sweating the small stuff. Last time cannot, now can. Now can. Share the video link with me, you know? Of course, can.